Hello, my name is Lambit Beecher, and my piece is called Kalevi Boyg in California. Uh, it was inspired by this image I have of Kalevi Boyg, who is the Estonian national hero. My mother is Estonian, uh, appearing in downtown San Francisco, and his exploits and his difficulty of understanding the modern world. The Institute's just been wonderful, especially because everyone's been so so warm and so welcoming and it's been a, a great learning experience but uh and also a great chance to to meet meet a lot of wonderful musicians the other composers um, and interact and learn a whole lot from, from jacques the conductor and steve our mentor the institute's been a wonderful learning experience for me since i've spent a lot of time lately writing chamber opera and chamber music on a very different scale than working with a symphony orchestra. A lot of the, the things that this, this week has really taught me was how to deal with details of orchestration, how to make my ideas speak in the most clear way. And often the answer is in, in taking away material or taking away fussiness. I had a, a w couple of wonderful sessions with, with Jacques, the conductor, and with Steve, Steve Mackey, our mentor and composer, and a lot of what they talked about was ways of of making things clear in the way that they speak. Steve suggested changing the dynamics in one section I had written because I was being too too detailed and it was the sense of the music was being lost in my attempt to be sort of subtle. The next project that I'm working on is a piece for solo viola and winds. And actually this institute's been a great preparation for that. Uh, this is a piece that will be it's being commissioned by uh, University of Michigan, Oberlin, and Detroit Chamber Winds and Strings. And then later in the fall, I'll be working on an opera that um, I've been developing with Opera Philadelphia. It's an opera about a, a man with Alzheimer's who's falling in love with another woman. It's a piece that I think is one that I've a really close connection to and, and I'm really looking forward to working on.